Hey yo, what it do, everybody? We've got a little, uh, a little bit of Fallout New Vegas for you. Hang on, hang on. Reset, retry. Three, two, one. Hey yo, what it do, everybody? We've got, uh, we've got another Fallout New Vegas quest here for you. A little bit of DLC that I have not experienced, and this is the last bit of it. So, this is going to be uh, this is going to be a good video for you guys. I'm not familiar with this quest line. Like I said, I haven't played the DLC. All I ever had was a uh, regular old Fallout New Vegas without the add-ons. So, this starts at the Mojave Drive-In. This crashed satellite we found it laying here. Old World Blues, 15 plus, I'm about to be level 40. You have a premonition that while you'll be unable to return to the Mojave until you solve the mysteries of the Big Empty, you will be able to take anything you can carry with you and you will be able to return to the Big Empty anytime after completing Old World Blues. If you're up to the challenge and you have all you want to carry with you, examine the satellite a little closer at the Atomic Wonders of Science. Yeah, sure. Let's do it. Screen, what's happening? Ooh, here we go! Let's do it! Let's do it! In the years before the Great War, Big Mountain had been the home to the brightest minds of the 21st century. Scientists of vision were drawn to the facility to tackle the greatest technological challenges of the era. They sought to create a new world, fueled by technology for the benefit of all mankind. Seems, seems valid. Sonic emitters, space age alloys, DNA hybridization, force field particle research. Yeah, sounds like really good stuff. Cranial, cardiac, and trauma surgery. Sounds like they use technology to help the humanity. The hopes and dreams of a century became hmm. realities in the electronic forges of Big Mountain. The nucleus of this research was the, the dome. dome, a huge stone facility that held the labs of every science known to man. Okay, so you can it do anything here. It was a think here. tank. Where no problem could not be solved, where no question well, a bunch of know it all be okay. answered. The Great War brought a new energy to Big Mountain and its scientists. Although sheltered from the front lines, the scientists waged their own war, fighting their battles at the atomic level. What does that mean? Equations and calculations marched endlessly across chalkboards and computer terminals toward one solution. Winning the war. Uh -huh. For years, the minds and computers of Big Mountain were a blaze of trajectories, weapon schematics, and okay. nuclear theories. Okay, so the problems began not helping to outpace humanity anymore. the solutions. First, geometrically. Then exponentially as the war escalated so did the questions right because they were All wondering the if they had even October done anything good in the first place 2077 wow that stuff makes it look like my screen scientists dirty. received an answer that put all their questions to rest in the aftermath big Ooh, mountain explosion. silent experiments went to sleep their creators slowly dying in the new oh, world candy. that had been left Thanks, behind. And the great stone in the middle of the big empty lay untouched, filled with countless technological wonders. Wonders that, in the end, had been answers to the wrong question. It's cryptic. Okay. You feel strangely heavier. A quick inspection of your body reveals faint surgical scars around your head, chest, and back. What? What's happened? Welcome to the Big Empty. I'm naked! Oh yeah, they did something to me. At least they left me my hat. Do they take stuff?
Alright, we're gonna go ahead and uh, RPG this. Actually, I have this. That's all I have. The sink. What is this? What is this place, the big empty? Nuka-Cola. Wonder if there's any stars in this DLC. Sunset Sarsaparilla stars. Doesn't look like it. Oh. I see. The sink. Mintats, waters. Huh. Think tank. A strange feeling of pacifism overcomes you and you find you cannot draw your weapon. Oh. What is this? I thought I heard the pacification fields kick in. Alright, nobody move. I'll handle Oh, this. you're weird. Be warned, oh. intruder! You are in the presence of a mighty think tank of Big Mountain! The collective geniuses of... Oh, it's Big Mountain. We! Not Big right, Empty. Oppenheimer, which one of you self-professed geniuses has been adjusting my volume knob? Who was it? Was it you, H? Huh. Oh, Dr. O, was it? Likely story. Oh, couldn't spark two neurons if they were in a lattice of biomed gel. I don't know what that means. What? Me? Breaking news, Klein. It wasn't me, all right? I'm the robotical engineer. Eight is sound waves. That's his specialty. You always do this. You Does always this guy have multi-personality disorder? It's not O, all right? It's... Enough! Either of you do it again, it'll be the last time. Now... Now... Great. Oh, I forgot what I was saying. What was I talking about? How are you all speaking through the one voice box? Are you the ones who perform the surgery? I don't give a shit what you have to say. Tell me why you hauled me here now. That response seemed demanding, as if cutting to the case. Uh, chase. How surgical. Reminds me of... Dr. Klein, a transmission from the Forbidden Zone, coming right at us. It can only be... If it isn't it is my, my own colleagues, colleagues the, the mighty think, think tank, tank of the Big Mountain, Mountain. Dr. Moby, big I fools. Oh, it is I, Dr. Mobius, <laughs> transmitting <laughs> from the Dome-shaped Dome in <laughs> Forbidden Zone, a zone wow. that is... It's for forbidden to you! Even now, my deadly robo scorpions scorpion. swarm across Big Mountain with their pincers and pointy laser tails. Soon, all science will be mine! Even the technology this guy is sealed in the classic villain, what? research centers cannot save you. So cower in your think tank. Wait for the end. That's all. Uh, goodbye. Oh, you're you're funny. Mobius. <laughs> Always Mobius. the same broadcast. He's clearly mad, driven insane by his flawed and imprecise kindergarten, kindergarten level. level research methodology. What are we going to do? There's no way we can breach the Forbidden Zone. There's those robot scorpions everywhere. The Forbidden Zone. Where no brain has ever entered, <laughs> nor ever returned. Except Dr. Mobius, and the technologies that could save us. They are out of our reach. And Dr. Mobius mocks us. Did you see his cracked monitor? He's clearly <laughs> let himself go. Okay, so they're what? all talking from Ask this guy. Ask the lobotomite for help. Hey, I think the bottom might levels in your logic assist pumps checked. 
If this lobotomite responded lobotomite? Time, then it is clearly what the fuck? Intelligent. Perhaps even displays heretofore unknown levels of helpfulness. But what if it's brain? We scooped that out. We don't even know where we left it. And for what? putting it back in, none of us have the knowledge. Yes, but it's still aware and responsive. Look at it. It's what? You took my now. brain out of my head? Is that what you're saying right now? Eyes. If we ask it politely and leave the part about the unnecessary, ruthless lobotomizing out, it might be favorably disposed to us. I know what you're saying. You took my brain out? We removed your brain. Yes. So soft. Barely ri barely Assholes. It's so flush with knowledge and experience. He just, he just called me a smooth brain. brain. Extraction technology has been standard practice at Big Mountain for an immeasurable amount of time. Once the brain was out, then came the coils. The Tesla coils. What? The coils of Nikola Tesla. Your head can no longer be crippled and it's resistant to chem addiction and shock from bodily damage. Brainless perk? What? Yeah, hey, no need to brag. Wherever your brain is, it's transmitting thoughts to you through the... what? The, um... Uh... The Tesla coils in its head! What the fuck? This is fortunate in many respects. If your brain was anywhere in the dome, why, you could access your aggression centers. Circumventing the pacification field, this is a no-no. We have never been in a fight. We do not want that. Ooh. Reminds me of my days in American High. And Richie Marcus. Richie Marcus? That doesn't explain the laser sutures on my chest and spine. Darla, was it necessary this time? I assume full responsibility. I take my duties in the prodding and excision of living, breathing tissue quite seriously. Although in truth, the autodoc had they put most inside of work me? already. Quite industrious. Almost cut into all my investigations. Once it had your investigation and I misplaced it, other organs huh. began to cry for direction, using your nerves as telegraph wires. Rather than let them send their signals, I removed them as well. Shh, little organs. Go Wait, so what did they tanks. cut out? Dala loves you. First was the heart. What? What? They took my heart out? You cannot be poisoned. The filters in your artificial blood pump will regulate breathe bleeding and healing. Allowing all healing items to function at a higher level. Oh. Huh, that's not bad. Oh wait, I mean, second was the heart. Brain was first. Third was the spine. The spine? I'm spineless, brainless, and heartless. Your spine has been replaced as well. Your torso can no longer be crippled, and your strength and damage threshold have been increased by one. These spine. are good things. Totally overrated. These are all really good things. Look at me with my lumbar and thoracic curvature. Never had a use for any of that. Spineless is what I prefer. Spineless. Ugh. You extracted. My brain, heart, and spine. That auto dock junk heap was one of Mobius's creations, like the rest of the talking scrap metal in the attic. After that, the brain lost itself. Not in the metaphysical sense. Might have gotten flushed into one of the pipes. Actually, that's pretty likely. What? If so, it was flushed, it was flushed. all the way to Mobius. Were... Wow. That is the sound of These flushing. assholes. By the Fisher of Rolando, enough of this biological surgery talk. Lobotomite, listen to my voice. It denominates me to ask, but we need your help. In what do we... most probable of probabilities, what? our enemy, Mobius, has your brain. This is not good. 
He will most likely come after our brains next. We want you to stop him. Somehow. With science. Um... How am I supposed to... I mean... I'm not mad that they did all that stuff. Because, like, I got all these extra perks now. So I'm kind of sort of cool with it. You need some kind of technology yes. to stop Mobius? It is our only chance. A desperate plan that came to us after Mobius' first broadcast. Maybe, just maybe, if we reclaim these buried technologies, we can put an end to Mobius and the horrors spawning from the Forbidden Zone. Forbidden Zone. What is the plan? You're losing me in the generalities. I need specifics. The plan was very complicated. We are still calculating how it would work if it succeeded. That is our part of the plan. What? Your plan is to figure out the plan as it... What? Why me? Um, no. You can't do it? Why not? You are equipped to retrieve the technologies with your primitive form. We are not. It's kind of huh. embarrassing. You have hands, and uh, a heartbeat, sort, sort of. of, and eyes, mostly the hands. There's, There's door, door handles and lockers <laughs> and... Enough! We need your help. Will you help us? Will you pay me? You spit it out before you bore me to death. Excellent. This is turning out much better than the activate the retreat protocols and cower in my room idea I had earlier. Agreed. Oh, and I've used my robotical knowledge to, um, uh, transmit the radio map waves. Radio map waves to. Uh huh. Settle down, Eight. I would have gotten it in a second, all right? Eight transmitted the last known coordinates of the research centers. They, um. They, well, move sometimes. Or get buried. Or blow up. Ooh. Eight is correct. All well, we need are the schematics. This does not mean we do not want the cold hard technology, Ooh, however. So do not give in to your biological tired laziness and decide you would sweat too much carrying them. You have a new spine. Use it. And even if you die in the spine. act of reclamation, Simply reaching them will auto-transmitify the schematics to us. That is still good for Ooh, us. Look at all these quest lines. If you don't tell me what I need to find, I can't help you, alright? The technologies are the X2 transmitter antenna array, used to focus coherent thought at excessively high frequencies. The psychoanalytic cardiac dampening sneaky stealth suit. A suit like nothing this world has ever heard, seen. And AIDS sonic sound wave emitter projecto gun. Able to broadcast sound at lethal frequencies. Sounds it also sick. gives a great bio gel massage. Uh. There. We have informed you of all we need. We estimate if you are focused, your time investment will be minimal. Uh, by our standards. Oh, really? If you work quickly, you will be the recipient of a gesture of gratitude from us. We do not bestow these old world gestures lightly. All right. Trust me. What, what if I take my time and explore the crater? What illogic is this? Keep your filthy penis tips. Penis tips. Feet. Tip secrets. There are things here no lobotomite was meant to see. Things that would astound and possibly Things terrify. that would astound and terrify? terrify? Yeah, we don't come into your lab and decant your solutions. <laughs> Only the magnificence of our monitors allow for true comprehension of the wonders of Big Mountain. Shield your jellied eyes lest they burn from your skull. Oh. Hmm. Doesn't sound like my style. I think I'm gonna do some exploring. You would not dare. Perhaps I can change your mind using the greatest of our sciences. The fence? The fence.
What's that? The radar fence that surrounds the big mountain crater will prevent, uh, protect you from straying uh, beyond the facility. I guess I'll have to the take it down. The mighty radar fence protects us all. Get too close to the blinking posts, and the proximity warning shall be your warning. Your warning. You are too close. If you get near it, your vision will blur as the electrodes in your head shut off one by one. Click, click, click. Oh. Possible memory loss will occur, along with long-term nerve degradation. It is tied to not having a brain attached to your nervous system. But that the makes nerve sense. degradation is nothing to worry about. Such degradation would take many lifespans to become huh. evident, and all biology dies. Such tiny inconveniences are less than the greater convenience and conveyance. Yeah, You see, true. if rendered unconscious by the pylons, you will be returned to the sink, seemingly instantaneously, by your deadened perceptions. So I can't leave. Oh, uh, Dr. Klein? Dr. Klein? If I may intersect for a moment. Intersect. What is it? The lobotomite is asking me things, oh, and I'm trying to ignore them. My processors can't ignore you both at the same time. <laughs> well, what you know how we asked it to fetch the sonic emitter thing? Turns out we already have it. <laughs> what are the odds? Oh, cool. So what I don't need this, to get that. high school science fair? Get your act together. You're making us look like a collection of round earthers. You're always yelling. My round receptors <laughs> can't take it anymore. Okay. And neither can my feelings. Huh. <laughs> I am yelling because the you contaminated specimens can't keep your probes off the volume knob on my voice module! If you have the gun already, I don't understand what you need. If there's a weapon you can give me, hand it over, I'll put it to good use. What do you need? It is truly the end of all intelligence when the lobotomite speaks more wisdom than you. Wow. Geniuses. Fuck you. So, if we have the sound wave, sonic projecto thing gun, then what Heisenberg's name. name do we need from X8? Anyone? I believe we need a new frequency embedded into the gun. It was designed to broadcast many sounds once charged. We just don't know the frequency. And it is lost in X8. Just as X8 is forever lost to us. The sadness of my high school days. The sadness of my youth. My youth lost. This, these robots are uh, really Oh, really, dramatic. Boros? All you did in high school was call me Fink Tattletail and all the kids you hated. <laughs> you little teacher's pet brown hound. Give. The lobotomite, the emitter. Does it have an audio effect frequency loaded? Does it? Oh, I don't think so. Wait. Audio frequency emitter? What Running is he sound doing? Wave gun? I think he's sonjaculating into the gun. Sonjaculating okay. into the gun? Warmed up. Huh? <laughs> oh. He's, he's... Ding. Turkey's done. Oh my god. You give it to the lobotomite. I'm not touching the... that thing. He oh, busted in it. I don't it. think so. He I'll busted in it. The robot busted in this electric gun. What the needs. fuck? Let me give it a little sonic sterilization first. Ooh. What the fuck? All right. These guys are oh, wild. My bacterial fresh. Here, my little teddy bear. What did you call I me? I thoroughly removed all Robco Terminate codes view from the device. It is clean, shiny, and ready for your hands. Oh. Sonic emitter revelation. Oh, do I want something that spits lead? Or do I want more energy cells? I'm pretty sure I have a shit ton of energy cells. What else do you what have? What did it say? Spit lead? What, like pencils? Oh, I think it wants a combustion pistol. Yeah, 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 a combustion pistol. A gun? Are you mad? We can't give it a gun. Guns kill. 
leave big open holes in you that are like sores, but worse. Dr. Eight is correct. We already have given the teddy bear a lethal sonic death ray. Filled with a sonic, sonic ejaculate. ejaculate. And sterilized by my soft wing. Oh my god, what the, the fuck? Would be the equivalent of following the glass of hemlock with an Abraxo chaser. What are y'all saying? And redundantly <laughs> deadly. If we're going to bring the Socratic method into it, fine. Give the Lobato bear a combustion gun. Lobato bear? bear? Something like that. These guys are, are fucking you crazy. Mad? We can't give it a gun. Guns. Wait, I said that already. Yes, I have the Cyberdog gun. The Cyberdog the gun. Floppy metal ears and the curious nose sensor. Here. Fine. Cool. Done. That gun makes me uncomfortable anyway. Always what is worried it? it's going to hump my chassis. Huh? Anything else, lobotomite? This gun looks really hungry. I'd like to make sure it gets fed lots of bullets. Fine. Moros, more ammo. The good stuff. Yes. Top shelf ammunition. Let's see. Hollow point? That's worthless, but tasty. Oh, and here's some JFP. As JFP? If bullets need jackets. The JFP might make it ill and poop a lot, but when you're hungry, you're hungry. What? I gotta see what this gun is they gave me. Hmm, yes, Magnum I believe JFT. Watts Electronics tended to make the battery shelf life on the low Yeah, give me end. some more energy cells. They certainly did. Since I can pick all the options. My vivisectors would always come <gasps> short right before climax. Oh my I god. Watts manufactured hollow discs, or was it hollow tapes? Never can keep those too straight. Anyway, we're out of small energy cells. Dala. Nice. You have you more. You have some? Why do we... Actually, never mind. Huh. I don't even want to know. And no, I don't want to handle your batteries. Just <laughs> pass them on to the little <laughs> yourself. Just we know what he does with the batteries. Freaky robots. These have been sterilized too, right? The sonic emitter should be sterilized, and more than enough for you to encircle your warm hands around, cradling it gently with your, your finger, finger muscles. Finger muscles. Careful where you're pointing that. That device wasn't always a weapon. It was more like a force field kind of thing. Once. Oh, Force really? fields prevent us from moving. Forward or backward. They are irritating. Oh. The sonic emitter was specially designed to disable our own safety fields here in Big Mountain. Interesting. When some of us lost our access passes, Dr. O. That only happened once! And I know you were behind still fielding my lab keys, Dalla. You formographer. Huh. Dr. O. Formographer. You rewind that comment. Wonder what that is. Plenty means. of rewinding already going on in your formography tapes. Oh. Surprise the things don't snap out of their cases with repeated observations. Oh, now I know what pornography is. Ew. Robot porn. Sonic emitter upgrade. It can disable force fields. Yes. Maybe. Well, no. Not currently. Or what that other yeah, robot keeps saying. Yeah, we lost that part of the schematics. Or Boros did, in one of his stupid labs, or inside one of his stupid pets. It is lost. All questions lead to this conclusion. The blue fields within Big Mountain shall be fielded with force forever. Oh, no, no, not unless I can take it down. I can care less about all of this. Can I go? Fine, so, yes, get these things for us. Do not attempt to comprehend their complicated schematics. That is for us to do. Oh, well, be sure not to tamper with anything. I'll get to these technological wonders and see how much damage I can do. I'll head out and then I'll be back with these things. See how much damage I can do. Well, good. 
What other token words spoken in this case? Uh, thank you? Uh, yes. Thank you. Wait, well, we had to force it. Uh, but is it a crime? The lobotomite will need yeah, I will. recuperation. Yeah, definitely Things I will. Like that. I volunteer my chambers so it might be stared at. My monitor radar is slowly scanning its form to collect oh. sensitive data. So you're going no, to, um, do robot porn to things us. to me? It could press buttons, turn lights on and off. Of course. What other lobotomites He's scared of me turning the lights on and off? Well, you give it Mobius' old room. That's where its brain got scooped out anyway. And plus, some of its parts are already there. Might be more comforting for it to hang out with its spine and heart. Home is where the heart is, after all. <laughs> See what I did there? Wet literal. I suppose. We'll have to move that couch out of there. Been putting that off too long. These robots are fucking funny. Eight says, let the lobotomite take the Sync Central Intelligence personality chip and reinstall it. That stuffy Mobius program Butler hmm. can walk the lobotomite, feed it, barter with it for us. It would also prevent it from going to Higgs Village and taking up residence there. With my teddy bears. And it would be nice to have it so close. You guys are creepy. Your logic combined with my desire to keep the think tank lobotomite free has swayed me. Here, I present the Sync Central Intelligence. Lobotomite, oh, take this chip to the sink. Switches. Plug it in and make sure the chip is clean or it could skip. Then wow, this is going to be a big DLC. Biologic demands you need of the sink. It will cater to most of your hormonal whims. This chip looks like it was mass produced. Are there others? Are there other chips? Are you echoing what he said, or are you asking for real? He's asking. Yes. Dr. Klein, there are many other personalities. If you recall, you hurled them off the sink balcony after your argument huh. with Mobius. It is not an argument if one is clearly right and the other is clearly wrong. Oh. I remember now. Yes, Lobotomite, there are other chips. If you want, find them. I believe they're stored on holotapes in many of our facilities. But you should stay out of those, no exploring and discovering things. The Sync Central Intelligence should be enough for no, your... No, 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 I want to go discovering needs. things. I can trade with the Sync Intelligence, then I'll need something to activate that function, don't I? I cannot dispute your logic. Do we have objects to activate the chip's exchange routines? What, like, stuff? Things? Yes, things. I don't know. Might be some old Nuka Cola or Sunset Sarsaparilla bottle caps lying around. It's not currency per se. Still, might be enough to trade the sink's trade routines. Mobius put that test line for caps in the code as a debug command, I think. I don't believe that okay. was Mobius's reason. His wild speculation concerning post Holocaust economic systems was quite extensive and of high decibel. Enough! Surrender these so-called bottle caps, Nuka and Sunset alike. In their role as things, they will serve as adequate test subjects. So all right, all right, my here. Caps. Cap away. Hope that stupid ship chokes on them. Hey, they gave me caps, too. This amount clearly represents a deficiency in the amount of caps I need. Again, your logic is unassailable in its simplistic need. Oh? Fine. It's not going to help. That ship will probably refuse them anyway, as stuck up Give as Give me more is. caps. I hate to come back and ask for more. A little extra would guarantee you're not disturbed. If I were not as intelligent as I am, I would feel as if perhaps I'm being tricked. Impossible. Oh. Impossible. More. Why don't you make the lobotomite a bottle cap factory, Klein? Or better yet, give it a ton of things to activate the chip. Yeah. Hold on, let's be logical about this. I don't need a ton, just as much as I can carry in trade. Again, the logic of the request is clear. <laughs> Tonnage is not needed, only adequate weight. Everyone, display your things. I do not understand, yet I am intrigued by this potential display. Yes. Could be more caps. 
No age, you don't need to fill up the emitter again, really. I means things for trade. Display for trade. All right, let's consolidate. Display for Let's trade, coin for wares, same Magazines, thing. Magazines, useless, more camps, medicinal supplies, useless. Here. Nice. Oh, nice. Here, they're giving me a whole bunch of stuff. Cool, good books, and more caps. Oh, and doctor's bags and stim packs, and a super stim pack. Wow. Having a store available would be helpful. It has a store connection, right? Yes, you may need to wiggle it in a bit, but don't force it. We can't recode them if you break it. There is no more we can do to aid you, and our patience levels are depleted. Now go. Rest in the sink if you must, Rest in but the leave sink. us to our research. Uh, if you're done, can we move again? My biogel's starting to crampagulate. Of course! Go man your science stations! Go! I am surrounded <laughs> by children! You guys are all goobers. Wow. What an interaction. Holy. How about we upgrade the... Yeah, let's upgrade energy weapons. No perks to pick. Oh wow, wow, I have a feeling this is going to be a really big DLC. We'll have to do this as a video series. Sink, big empty, the sink. Alright, now let's rest. Wherever the bed is. Yeah, whatever's inside did make me feel stronger. This is where your brain should be, but it's missing. This is my heart. Apparently cranial surgery complications required its removal until your brain is returned. Your heart can't be trusted to keep beating in your body. Your new heart seems to be working just fine, however. Okay. That's ridiculous. Is there anything good down here? Ammunition. Cool. Oh yeah, what was that gun that I got from them? The Kyber Dog Gun? This is sick! Feed it. This is sick! Holy crap, that's amazing! Damage isn't very high, but it looks so cool! And then this one. Oh, it makes noise when you take it out or put it away. Oh, that's neat. You, you hear that? Oh. That's amazing. That is amazing. Well, let's drop some stuff off here. Let's drop off the machine gun. Yeah, just the machine gun. stuff doesn't have any weight so all right then I guess we're not dropping anything off well I think that's a good spot to uh, go ahead and call it for this video make sure you guys check out these other videos that I'm going to drop in the near future going over this exact same uh, quest line this exact same DLC on Fallout New Vegas, but until then, y'all take care, be safe, stay chill, peace!